Hello viewers. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to do the self pip writing task one. In fact, I'm going to show you how to do the letter writing. Let's see what do we have here. It's an informal letter. You are relocating to a new city where you have a good acquaintance. So you would like to write to him or her asking for some basic information about the city. Inform him or her of the reason you have decided to move. Ask him or her about some questions you have in mind. Make some plans to get together once you settle. So it's an informal letter. How to begin an informal letter? Either you say by saying, hello, John. I hope you are doing well. I'm busy as usual with my work and household things. I am writing this letter to convey my regards and the relocation plan that I have in mind in the near future. Okay, so we have addressed the first, um, not the prompt, but uh, the main uh, subject itself. You are relocating to a new city where you have a good acquaintance. So you would like to write to him or her asking for some basic information about the city. Inform him or her of the reason you have decided to move. So now I'm going to write, first of all, I am relocating to Vancouver because it is pretty cold here at Edmonton. Furthermore, I have I have received I have received a job offer in your city and I and I will relocate immediately. Okay, so first of all, I'm relocating to Vancouver because it is pretty cold here at Edmonton. Furthermore, I have received a job offer in your city and I will relocate immediately. Then what? Moreover, or you can say the main reason that I am writing This letter 
is because I am concerned about the housing in your city. Moreover, the commute to the workplace is another issue that is my query. All right, so the main reason that I'm writing this letter is because I'm concerned about the housing in your city. All right, in is missing. We can always do the proofreading later in your city. Moreover, the commute to the workplace is another issue Therefore, I want you to find out these find out a decent apartment and Therefore, I want you to find out a decent apartment and write back to me at the earliest with regard with regards to the easy commutability. I have also enclosed. Okay, you can directly inform about the rent that you're looking at because that is very important. Uh, and or if you are looking for a second hand vehicle or uh, you're planning to travel through Metro or any other bus facility that we have already mentioned. Therefore, I want you to find out a decent apartment and write back to me at the earliest and regards uh, with regards to uh, the earliest with regards to the easy commutability. All right. So we have to also see how many words we have written. That is very important. We have written close to 126 words. All right. Okay. Then what? Then what? Now we have addressed, inform him or her of the reason you have decided to move. Ask him or her about the questions you have in mind. So all that is being addressed. Make some plans to get together once you are settled. All right. So um, I will be happy to meet you once I am settled in my job and we can catch up and we can catch up soon. I will be happy to invite you to my home for a dinner and we can also watch a favorite movie in my new smart TV. or smart television. Okay.
So it's around 172 words. It's a wonderful um, writing task one. So we can conclude here. I hope to see you soon. Please write back to me when you get the chance. Having read this at the instant being in the sleep. All right, so we can conclude here. Best regards, Sandy. Let me proofread it once again. Hello, John. I hope you're doing well. I'm busy as usual with my work and household things. I'm writing this letter to convey my regards and the relocation plan that I have in that I have in my mind, in mind, in the near future. First of all, I'm relocating to Vancouver because it is pretty cold here at Edmonton. Furthermore, I have received a job offer in your city and I will relocate immediately. Or you can say, I have plans to relocate immediately. And I have plans to relocate immediately. The main reason that I'm writing this letter is because I'm concerned about the housing in your city. Moreover, the commute to the workplace is another issue. Therefore, I want you to find out a decent apartment and write back to me at the earliest with regards to the easy commutability as well. I will be happy to meet you once I am settled in my new job. and we can catch up soon. I will be happy to invite you to my home for a dinner and we can also watch a favorite movie in my new smart television. I, ho I hope to see you soon. Please write back to me once having read this letter instantaneously. Best regards, Sandy. So what are the things that you need to take care of here is Write a simple to a compound sentence. Take care of the punctuation wherever it is required. And uh, try to write appropriately with grammar. That is what is required for the part one. Of course, I haven't seen a semi-formal letter on the self writing task one. Mostly you will be given a formal letter or an informal letter. So we have already seen a lot of formal letters in my earlier videos. So this is an informal letter that I thought I would write because I've been getting a lot of uh, queries about an informal letter. So I thought I would write it and showcase it to you how to write it quickly well within the 27 minutes stipulated time. I hope viewers you enjoyed this video. My name is Sridhar Santanam and I'm the founder of self -Hip Academy. Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel and smash the like button. Also comment below this way. I'll be able to come up with more such videos in the future. Thanks for watching. See you on the other side.